cooking apa? Hi, this is cooking apa? Tonight apa has some uh, chicken, some sea cucumber, and one can of uh, braised abalone. Uh, nowadays, braised abalone, the smaller ones, is actually very, very cheap. Less than 30 ringgit. So, yeah, you can just buy it anywhere. And um, I'm just going to combine these three things together and make it a CNY recipe, which is um, brings chicken with abalone and also cucumber. So first of all, I have some, uh, this is some chicken parts. Yeah, you can use any chicken part that you have. And I have a few pieces of silk cucumber. This is already uh, rehydrated. Yeah, usually I just buy the frozen one so that I can just defrost it and use it straight away. The only thing to take note about sea cucumber, I will let you know shortly. And of course, we'll be using, uh, I always, there's usually two types of uh, braised, ab uh, sorry, abalone can here. <coughs> I prefer to use the braised type because I can then use the braised sauce in the can. And we will prepare some ginger and also garlic. So first of all, we are going to open. <coughs> now this pharmacy also sell ab canned abalone. See, we have the braised broth. I'm going to use this braised broth <coughs> to broth all the ingredients. Check out the braised broth. Look at how beautiful it is. See? It saves all your time. So we are going to saute the ginger and also garlic. The moment you start seeing the ginger started to curl up and the garlic started to brown, you can actually put in the marinated chicken. I marinated with a little bit of salt. Or you can use light soya sauce itself. Let me double check the anger. Okay. Mmm, already very fragrant. <laughs> right after that, we can actually put in the. <coughs> Ooh, very thick. I'm going to add some water to dilute it. And I will put in the sea cucumber as well. Now, the thing about sea cucumber is, uh, especially the smaller sizes like this, it can actually melt if you cook it for too long. So that's why you need to be careful. Uh, I will be cooking, I will be braise this chicken and the sea cucumber for probably about 10 to 15 minutes. So uh, I'm not worried about it melting. Uh, huh? Some, if you cook more than 15 minutes, it can melt. Since I already diluted just now, so I probably want to add in some uh, salt. A bit of light soy sauce, a few dishes of white pepper. We can put in the abalone towards the end, don't hurry. So once it is boiling, we are going to close it with a lid and let it simmer under medium low or medium for at least about 15 minutes. Alright, this is after approximately close to 13-14 minutes. You will notice actually the sea cucumber will actually shrunk, yeah? This is why you would, uh, I did not even cut my sea cucumber just now. Getting smaller and smaller, I think it's good enough. Lah. You can add a bit of salt here because we already diluted the, um, the sauce just now. Yeah? So uh, I still have one more thing I haven't added, which is the abalone. Ooh, four pieces of abalone inside. And basically, the dish is ready. I have a lot of sauce. Um, actually, you, this dish will goes very well with uh, white porridge for sure. All I need is just to heat out the, the abalone will do. This dish is basically done. If you prefer darker color, add some dark soy sauce. By the way, you can do this dish just with the chicken and also abalone without the sea cucumber. No problem at all. Alright, so here's my very simple uh, braised chicken sea cucumber with abalone. If you like my video, do share my video on your Facebook to your friends. Come to Cooking Appa Facebook fan page to click like and follow button. Follow Appa on the Instagram and subscribe to Cooking Appa YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.